Today we are here in Hocking Hills, Ohio, and we're gonna do Hocking Hills State Park. You ready, Dawn? Ready. Let's do this. It is a beautiful day here in Ohio, and we're gonna do Hocking Hills. Now there's so many of you out there have suggested this to us over the last like six years of doing YouTube. And here we are, today is the day we are gonna do this. First, we're gonna go into the visitor center because we know nothing about Hocking Hills or, or what it is, but we do know one thing, it is beautiful. So here are some of the wildlife we can come across. They have bobcats, they have the eastern copperhead. That's good to know. They also have a timber rattlesnake. These are some of the scenes we're gonna see today. All these little pathways and stuff. Very beautiful. This here explains how Hocking Hills was formed. Pretty much it was sandstone that was washed away. This is what they call the doubles bathtub. And that's just one of the things we're gonna see today. They also have these little rock shelters. And there's- Waterfalls on Man's Creek. Yep, beautiful waterfalls. There's a major passage of rock houses, passages for on the major sandstone. Let's stop looking at these photos and go see the real thing. They have a very nice gift store here. And I have another pin for the map. And look at that, it's a big one too, but it's a nice one. I love that poster. They have this interactive area. It kind of tells you what it's going to be like when you hike on these trails. And these are those types of steps we'll have to go up. It kind of gives you an insight of what you're going to get yourself into. So this says, welcome to Hocking Hills State Park, the most exciting trails in the state. So this is the beginning of the trail here, trail entrance. Now, a lot of these trails are, are one way. So you have to do like a loop in order to get back. Oh, wow, look at down there. This does remind me a lot of Tennessee. I know a lot of folks say, this is gonna remind you of Tennessee. It reminds me of uh, Rock City, doesn't it? Yeah. Wow. That is, that is beautiful. So when the water is flowing, there's probably a beautiful waterfall through here. There is a lot of steps in this trail. So if you climb down, you're gonna have to climb <laughs> back up. And this is where we're heading, Old Man's Cave. That way. We just came from up there. So the trail is not quiet. There's a lot of folks hiking on this trail. It's a consistent flow. So maybe if you got here earlier in the morning or it might be a little more quiet. So pretty much we just walked down into a gorge. Absolutely beautiful though. And there's Dawn. <laughs> what do you think? 
Oh, huh, there's a ninja course coming up. Oh, wow, look at that bridge up there. Oh, wow, that is a really unique bridge. <laughs> and look at the cliff. It's got some acoustics. Hello? You hear that? <laughs> yeah. This is a nice trail. <laughs> and then there's a little, a little cave back in there. Yeah, look at the the fungus or wow. It's so green. Oh, that was a very unique bridge. And there's another bridge above us. We'll get to, I guess, in a little bit. Let's keep hiking on. It does kind of remind you of Rock City. It does. It's kind of like Rock City. Mm -hmm. A little fish just swimming around. Yeah, so there's these little caves, but it's kind of muggy down here, isn't it? <laughs> it is. Well, that's a creepy little little guy there hanging out. Oh wow, look at that cave there. That overhang. It's huge. Wow, that's I'm gonna hike on up there and, and check it out. There's a little little bit of a of a crossing here. Not too bad, but just a little little and then I have to climb up up there. Not too bad. What do you think of the hike so far? I'm enjoying it so far. Definitely reminds you of the Great Smoky Mountains. So if you live in Ohio and you kind of want to feel what the Great Smoky Mountains is like anyways, this is a place, but uh, it's really cool. It's a beautiful gorge. It's got very nice paths to uh, move around in. And you can go off trail a little bit like I did and climb up the side, which I like to do. I went the other way around. Yeah, Don took the bridge. <laughs> you know, it's almost like you're living in a fairy tale land, you know? Um, you know, something like out of the movies. Like one of those, yeah, like one of those magical places, you know? You don't even feel like you're in Ohio. You feel like you're in a, in a distant land of some sort. Look at how green this moss is. Wow. You know, it kind of reminds me of the green in Ireland. You know, that shade of green you find in Ireland. Oh, look at this rock formations here. Wow. You can tell there's like kind of like a different mineral there. 
And we have made it to Old Man's Cave. Yeah, it's like a stairway cut out of the side of the rock there. Oh, wow, it looks like it's real, real deep. Let's go in here and check it out. I think we brought some of that Tennessee heat with us. It's a hot one. It's steamy down here. It's 80, I think it's 88 degrees today here in Ohio. But look at that. <laughs> that is that is old man's cave. Looks looks scary, doesn't it? Go check this out. Let's go explore this. This is what everybody comes here for, or at least one of the sites. Oh, wow. It's cool in the tunnel. It's dark in here. It's dark, isn't it? It's kind of scary. <laughs> kind of scary, huh? Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. And that's the stairwell we just came down. So Lower Falls is is that way. And then Old Man Cave is over that bridge. It is. Let's get a closer look at it. Wow. Who would have thought all this beauty here in Ohio? Mm -hmm. You know, it's, it's stunning. That's what they call the Sphinx head. Um, I do see a face. But I... You see the eye? Yeah, if you come back here, you can see it. It does look like a... Oh, I can see it. You can see his nose. Mm -hmm. So so there you can see the nose. And you can see the mouth. Yeah. So if we would have continued this way, we would have went to the lower falls. But we decided we're going to head to Old Man's Cave. Because that's where all this crazy beauty is at. And we're not here for a long time, but we're here for a good time. And we're going to cross this great bridge. Look at that. It's like something out of a, out of a fairy tale or something. I love the, the brick. Oh, wow. Look at the, the beautiful waterfall. Oh wow, we get to climb all the way up there. You know, that's probably the, one of the most beautiful things I have ever seen is in this gorge here. Oh, there's another little cave. Now, I believe there's a story. It's actually a true story about an old man that did live down in here. And uh, I guess he used to trade with the Indians or Native Americans in the area 
and uh, wow. And the dogs are, boy, that dog bark echoes down in here, don't it? Yeah, it's really loud. It is real loud. And I'm going to duck down just a, a little bit, but. Yeah, got some steps here, but not too bad. You can see where the sandstone was washed out a little bit there. There's those dogs over there barking. We just came down there and then we walked through the tunnel. We've come out down there. We walked across the bridge here and then up through this little tunnel and we're standing here on the ledge and look at the ledge it over hangs us totally wow definitely a, a very beautiful place there there's dawn all the way up there <laughs> So they call this the old settler's cabin. Huh. I think it's just for presentations. And this is the Gorge Overlook Trail. That was that A-framed um, bridge that we looked up on as we went underneath it in the gorge. Yep, and there's that that bridge down there, that, that funky style bridge. This definitely reminds me of uh, Rock City. It's just so so much like Rock City. Yeah. These trails are pretty easy. I think almost anybody can do it. If you take your time, you won't have a problem. So we're gonna walk a 0.2 of a miles up here. Then we're gonna get another trail and we're gonna go to the Devil's Bathtub. Ooh. What do you think about the Devil's Bathtub? So scary. <laughs> I didn't know the Devil took baths, to be honest with you. You think Devil takes baths? I'm sure he does. You think he'd be afraid of water though because of all the fire and brimstone and stuff, you know? I might cool him off though. <laughs> You think he wants to be cooled off, though? Yeah. You know, I always, you know that old saying, you can sell ice in Hades, and then you're doing pretty good, right? And we have come 
to a cliff. <laughs> wow, look at that beautiful waterfall. A yeah, nice little swimming hole, but you can't swim in the state park. Got some beautiful wildflowers growing. Absolutely beautiful. Well, let's walk over to that bridge and take that in. <laughs> so we're on that bridge and there's a, a little waterfall just over there. And the other way. Oh wow, look at that. Someone lost their hat. Someone did lose their hat, didn't they? Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. Definitely a nice swimming hole. And we were standing just over there not too long ago. Oh, it's even more beautiful down here. This is like something you would see in a movie. It doesn't even look real, you know? That is totally amazing. That's probably one of the most beautiful waterfalls I've seen in a while anyways. I can't get enough of that waterfall. Just amazing. Uh, now we're gonna hike out of the gorge here. And this here is the Doubles bathtub. Let's get a better look of it. <laughs> it does look like a bathtub, doesn't it? Yeah, it, does. it does. Wow, it's like all the layers have eroded. Kind of looks scummy. Yeah. I guess the double would maybe take a bath in there, right? <laughs> I already got them taking a bath in there. He did. You can see all those fish down there swimming around the devil's bathtub. Yeah, it's pretty deep there. Like these little <laughs> <Man squeezes. laughs> yeah, it's a little a little narrow. <laughs> it looks like there's a little little cave over there that needs to be explored a little bit. Let's cross over. Oh wow, it it does go way back in there. I 
Yeah. Yeah, there's a little a little cave over here. We're here at the Ash Cave Trail. And we are here and it's a it's a loop. This looks like it's a point three of a mile and then a point three of a mile back. We got in the car and we drove to the other side of the park to come over here to Ash Cave. And just like that, there's a, a huge amphitheater, or a cave. Wow, that's, that's way up there. Definitely impressive. We'll just go underneath this tree here and Hey Dawn, there's, there's trees above our head, and if they fell, they would make a mess. Oh, well, they would, they would hurt us, anyways. <laughs> and I see there's a little waterfall just over there. It's cool in here, doesn't it? It feels like yeah, ten degrees. Yeah, it's like ten degrees cooler. Hello. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like a like a beach. Like sand, yeah. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah. This is like something you would see like in Arizona or at least something like that. And it's beautiful here. And it's so cool and so much cooler. Yeah, it's oh, like it's really trying to get the the depth of it, it's a lot bigger in real life than this camera <laughs> is gonna. Echoes. Hello. A little bit. You could probably put on a really good concert here, you know. It's not a big waterfall, but it's definitely impressive. Super tall. I want to go down there and get get a closer, closer it's look. Heavy rain, I bet you it's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, I would say so. Wow, that's, we're standing directly under it. It's almost like a shower. Very cool. And then, goes all the way. Wow. And the sun's just peeking through the trees. It's like taking a cool shower. <laughs> I'm getting wet. I am getting wet. <laughs> it's like Feels good. In the, sh the rain or something, like a shower. Yeah. Very cold water. Very refreshing. Mm -hmm. That's. I'm soaked. Yeah. Feels good. Fe feels good, anyways. And that's where we were down there. So you gotta climb a little elevation to to get out of here
that rock almost looks like a face. You got the two eyes, a nose, and a, and a mouth. Definitely a lot of steps to get out of here. <laughs> That's the trail we came in on and it goes all the way up to the falls to the cave there. And then you come down this steep embankment on the way back, so. That was Hawking Hills, and we're back here in the studio because we didn't do a closing because we, we hiked like five miles that day. Yeah. Uh, what did you think about it? I really enjoyed Hawking Hills. It, it was so beautiful and so scenery. So much scenery there. It was. It was. It's like walking in a different land. Like, it, it doesn't seem to be real, you know what I mean, with the way it is. It's so much, like glory and beauty and yeah it was like trolls or fairies were going to come out at any time really super beautiful uh thank you all out there for uh suggesting this to us um over the years we finally made it it was great um it reminds me a lot of rock city in tennessee here and it reminds me a lot of just tennessee in general uh definitely uh was, was good all the way around i guess the big question is would you do it again yeah, I would do it again. It was well worth it. Yeah. Um, we didn't do all of Hocking Hills. You know, there was the Rock House we didn't do. There's a couple other waterfalls. So we'll definitely... Leave that for next time. Yeah, yes. We definitely have something to do next time. But folks, that's going to do it for today. Here, well, in Tennessee, if you guys like this vlog, give it a thumbs up. Also, please subscribe so you don't miss these upcoming Smoky Mountain... Well, and these upcoming road trip adventures. <laughs> Let's get it right. And until next time. Thanks for watching. Bye, everybody. Bye, you can tell that um, we got allergies really bad, and uh, it's been it's been rough. We were outside for like three or four days on this trip straight, you know, like 12-hour days, and somehow we got pollen, and we're all... Uh, 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 so, <laughs> bye, everyone.